Greetings everyone and welcome back to a new video. Now this is a bit different than what I'm used to. I've been doing Final Fantasy XIV content for a long time, mostly for streaming and stuff like that. But I'll be honest, I've definitely taken a break since September last year because I was kind of burned out from just everything. Like I have done a lot of things within the game and I feel like I'm just waiting for the next big thing and then I'll just get back into it. But for now, you know, taking my break, making sure I can play some other games because it does take away a lot of my own time for other stuff. But regardless though, I actually wanted to check how my character would look like with the whole update. That's kind of it. So I actually want to go and create a new character. Um, I'll make it all from the beginning. So now you actually can check out the Hroth Gal, I guess it's what they call it. <laughs> oh my god, this is so odd. It definitely looks already a different than what I recall. But you know what? It is a bit jarring seeing this outfit because they're still very... Uh, I mean, they look a bit upscaled. Maybe it's just me, but it still doesn't compare to obviously the new armor pieces. I do have to say that. And this is usually the only setting I use whenever I want to check my character because I feel like it best represents the lighting. The other ones are very niche. I feel like this one wouldn't work as well. And honestly... It's always a problem because one of the hardest things I always tend to uh, choose for is the, the the skin color. I always struggle and then whenever I'm playing the game, I notice that in a lot of the areas, the skin color actually doesn't make sense to what I wanted to have. So <laughs> I suffer from it and then I need to buy a Fantasia and get that shit fixed. And it's, oh man, but I've learned from my mistakes. I generally nowadays, if I really want to, check which skin I need to use. I make a new character on another world and see how that plays out. My character's a Mikode though. <laughs> I'm one of those guys, I'm sorry. More clothes, race, job. Probably gonna be playing a lot of Viper, but uh, yeah. Man, this is so cool. Uh, this would be Seeks of the Sun. I honestly can't remember most of these settings, but obviously my character creation would be saved. I can't even choose my own <laughs> height. That's because uh, I'm just too fucking. I'm massive, bro. <laughs> bro I, I bet you already, like I said, that this is going to look so weird whenever I'm going to be. <laughs> yeah, this looks way too light already. Do I. I don't even get to see all Hestas, but I get to see the new one, though. That looks cool, man. Yeah. Damn. Uh, generally, though, I always use the... Um, where is it? Where is this bad boy? There it is. Yeah, this has always been my look. I mean, this is so odd because it, it's definitely dark brown, but it's close to gray, so I can never figure this shit out every time I fail. Like, I swear to God, it looks brown on the on the blocks. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I don't know if my face cam is... My face cam is in front of it, but there's like... You can see the RGB and stuff like that, but it just looks gray. I don't know how to fix this shit. Oh, there we go. I had to get one. Ah. Yeah, that was it. This was the setting. Jesus. Oh, my God. No, they... They upscaled it, didn't they? It, it looks slightly upscaled, the armor. But maybe that's just me. I do have to say, sometimes the characters still feel a bit flat. Unless you kind of, like move them with the sun and have more shadows. I think the skin color is still not what I want it to be. Why is it now zoomed into the bottom? There we go. Yeah, generally I can't do anything unless I check this one. Yeah, this one makes me look way too brown and I, I look tanned. This one looks me... I look dead inside. I look green. I generally don't remember which option I have. Probably this one. Yeah, I definitely always have either six or... Or nine. I believe the benchmarking should now start so I can actually see the better lighting options, which is <laughs> a little bit more important for me. Okay. I'll be honest, this is the first time I actually even do the benchmarking thing. Like, even for Shadowbringers and stuff, I just never bothered. 
I felt like it wasn't that important. I don't know if it'll be fully optimized because I'm trying to record in 2K quality as well. Oh yeah, I love having no armor. <laughs> Just the standard. Very bright right now, I do have to say. But I'm sure that's supposed to be like that. I kind of wish I had the game installed now, just so I could... I'm going to assume that's the best way to import your actual character. But I try to recreate it the best way possible. So... Ooh, that quality looks good, man. Animations I'll never be able to recreate while playing the game. <laughs> Let's go! my mount that I never use. <laughs> I usually either use the Rathalos mount or I guess one of the PvP ones. I can't remember exactly which one. The one with the like an axe on the shoulder. It's been a while since I played it, right? Give me, give me a break, please. That will be our new uh, end game uh, food to take before a raid. Oh, bro. I <laughs> when I actually watched part of the trailer, I was like, are those sheep? <laughs> I was watching in low quality and I didn't pay attention. I'm like, okay, that's so special, I guess. I don't know if the score is good. I'm going to assume it's fine. Whee! I'm sure I'll probably get a higher score if I wasn't recording at the same time on the highest quality. I mean, this is basically just a trailer, but with my own character. Uh, but I actually haven't watched it fully. I just watched snippets. This is uh, what an S rank hunt is going to look like. Oh, I saw a red mage ability. Oh, samurai. I believe they also changed some of the combat for the Dark Knight, which is... God bless, man, because I'm so sick and tired of the 1-2-3 combos. I really love Dark Knight, but sometimes I just... Uh, I struggle playing it because it's so boring. Nice. Fucking rainbow field on the right side, jeez. <laughs> ah, yes, the one thing I skip on most of the time. You can't fold me for this. Hey, bro, those shadows look good, man. Hey, the dark... <laughs> bro has got a raid gear on, baby. Can I say, by the way, I did notice this. This music... Da -da -da. It sounds like near Replicon when you go to the... Like the harbor city? Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. It has that kind of vibe. Obviously, the notes do change after like the first three or four. But hey, still, man. Oh. <laughs> On our way to an S rank. Sorry, man. I've just been doing so many of those fucking train hunts. It's ridiculous. <laughs> like. It doesn't look like that. It looks like an absolute mess. Hey. Still, some of the running animations are kind of the same. Kind of wish they would change some of that as well. <laughs> Wait, you want to... <laughs> Wait, why are you guys tanking the two sides and I'm just trying to gang up on this one Donny, bro? I'd be dead. You know what would be... F I mean, I don't know if it would be fun because it'd look fucking weird, but this this whole cinematic thing... I wish for... an option that if you finish a raid that's like two or three minutes, you can watch it back, but with these cinematics and just see how weird it is. Like, you have all this cool shit and then a Dragoon just jumping backwards off the fucking platform. And this is all part of the one cinema, bro.
Nice. Yeah, I definitely did see this part of the fight from the trailer. So, yeah. I believe that was it. No, there's more. Oh, <laughs> loading time, eight, okay. 18,693. I'm assuming that's okay. I did it, guys. Yeah, extremely high. Woohoo. Yeah, nice. I'd be fucking sad if that wasn't the case because I paid good money for this shit. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I paid good money for this shit. But it'd be worth it. Okay, anyways. Gonna be back to the yeah okay well i'm gonna leave it here i'm gonna thank you all for watching it's been an absolute pleasure and uh yeah it it looks it looks very cool it looks very cool i'm happy with it yeah anyways thank you all and i'll see you in the next video peace